Hey everyone, and welcome to another It's Elementary STEM video with the Eaton Public Library. Today, we're going to be making Newton's Cradles. If you're not familiar with Newton's Cradle, the Newton's Cradle is a science experiment which demonstrates Newton's third law of motion. So let's go ahead and get started. To make the Newton's Cradle, you're going to need a set of craft sticks, some marbles, and a straw. You will also need some glue, some string of some kind, a pair of scissors, and some tape. You can use many different kinds of glue. Hot glue is the easiest, but make sure you have an adult around if you're going to use this. If you pick up the kit from the library, your straw has already been hot glued to your marbles. If you need to make these yourselves, simply hot, uh, attach the hot glue to the straw, add the marble, and then cut them off. To make the frame for your Newton's cradle, start with four craft sticks and glue them together. Make sure you have the ends as flush as possible. Once you have these four pieces glued together, take another two craft sticks and glue them here and here. Make sure these two craft sticks are lined up well so that you can have a solid surface to glue upon. Set these frames aside and allow them to dry. Once your frames are dry, take another two craft sticks, add glue, and set your frame up on top of them. You may need an additional pair of hands to help with this part of the project. Make sure that your double framed pieces are at the top and the bottom. Take another pair of pieces, another craft stick, and put them across the tops to add additional stability. Hold your structure until it dries. Once your cradle is dry, take your fishing line or yarn or cord and begin to thread your marbles onto it. Thread one marble. You'll want approximately eight inches of cord. And then either tape or glue your marble onto your cradle. You can either tape it this way or this way. If you tape it this way, you can mark off half inch increments, which are where your marbles are going to go. When you place your marbles on the Newton's cradle, you will need them to line up horizontally and vertically from both the side and the top to get optimal effect. Tape your marbles in place or glue them. Once you have your first marble in place, all other marbles must line up on it. Continue stringing your marbles. To get optimal function, you may need to add some additional glue to the sides of the straws to hold them in place. This will prevent your marbles from shifting as they impact each other. When 
And there you have it, a Newton's Cradle.